Um, I think for Bangladesh, um, more research is needed in understanding this backlash because um, it's happening in a space that's uh, shrinking due to censorship, due to um, a political climate that's not welcome um, to a multitude of voices existing together. I think research is very important uh, component and aspect of uh, uh, really digging out the issues around uh, backlash because when backlash happens essentially it means that somebody is benefiting from it so uh, how do we then know what are some of the reasons uh, of uh, that kind of backlash and why do they want they don't want to see progress when it comes to issues of uh, gender equality. I think it's super important for us to understand how this kind of thing happened in a country that was really going well, progressing, and how did this happen? What is the basis of this uh, backlash? How is it taking place in policy? What is the kind of resistance that we're putting against this kind of uh, backlash? So there's a lot of work to be done on that. And uh, I hope that we're able to uh, bring back some uh, ways or find some means of, you know, actually resisting and combating, confronting this type of backlash that's happening in Brazil.